Hey, welcome back to another Tonga Island content. And today we will be updating you on the Ikaretahi road to the World Cup 2023 here in France. And when I say here in France, I mean here in Europe. And um, first of all, you gotta go congratulate um, the island kingdom of Tonga for winning for winning the game against Australia two weeks ago, uh, celebrating 50 years of their first win in 1973, but uh, in uh, against the Wallabies. And um, this two weeks ago, they won um, again um, the game. Um, and what was interesting about that game was the fact that this is probably the best national team that Tonga has ever had because you are talking about world-class athletes that have played for the All Blacks and the Wallabies coming back to play for their kingdom because they have changed the rules and we are very thankful to have these former players from other countries and you know, qualify with their, for their families background, roots, to come back and play for Tonga. So um, I will read out the, the names and the numbers. So the first thing here with the squad is number, your forwards have eight players, one through eight. Uh, they're the biggest and um, they're the biggest and the tallest in the team. So, um, you know, they'll be in the scrums. So uh, I will read out their names and the towns they're from. And then we'll, we'll go to the backs and then read their na uh, names after. But as you can see, I will just na uh, read out their names and the towns they're from in Tonga so that uh, their families uh, will be proud to hear that um, their name being called out for the World Cup. So let's start off with our number one loose head prop. Well, you know what? I won't call out uh, what positions they play because it'll be too confusing for a lot of uh, people that really don't know rugby, but we'll try to just call out the numbers and their names, okay? And also um, what, what uh, professional team they're playing for uh, around the world. So we'll start off with uh, number one is um, Figataha, Figauruaki. Uh, Siegfried Fisi'ihoi from Falaleu Utui Vava'u. So um, he plays professionally in France uh, for the team Po. So we're moving on to number two. So every time you see there's a line out, your number two will be tossing in the ball. His name, or Fikaua, go Samuela Moli uh, from Lema Tua Vava'u and also from Te'ekiu Tomatapu. And uh, Mr. Moli plays his professional rugby for the Moana Pacifica in New Zealand. So, Figatolu, number three, Ben Tameifuna, Pea, Tongatapu. And he plays professionally from, uh, in France, you know, for Boudou. <laughs> I like the French, Boudou. <laughs> I'm not trying to make fun, uh, just having fun. Okay, so, um, yeah, so, uh, by the way, he will be turning um, 32 in, um, Next month, in August, um, I guess um, his birthday before uh, the World Cup. Um, going on. So our uh, figure five, uh, our number four is um, Halaleva Fifita from Kameli Reimatu Avavau, uh, whose brother is also via our number eight, Thomas number eight, via Fifita. So, um, but by the way, on the 29th of, um, of July um, for the game against Japan, he, we, he's going to turn, um, you know, that will be his birthday. And he plays professionally for um, uh, Connacht in um, Ireland. Yeah, so, uh, yeah, I guess he will be turning 34. And uh, moving on, our number five, Figanima Ko Samuela Lousi, from Kanokupolu, Tongatapu, Leimatua, Vavau. And he plays professionally in Wales for the Scarlets. And um, congratulations, to, uh, he just turned 32 on uh, July 20th. Moving on. So our number six, Fikaono. Tanginoa Halai Fonua from Fatumu Tongatapu and also from Tugulalo Homa Vavau. And uh, plays professionally for um, here in France for Grenoble. And uh, since we are talking about birthday, he will turn 27 on September 20th during the World Cup. So our number seven, Figafitu, was, is Solomon Funaki from Fangaopilolevu, Tongatapu, and also from Pangai Haapai. Plays professionally from Moana Pacifica in New Zealand. Moving on, uh, Figavalu, 
our number eight, Vaya Fifita from Kameli Lema Atu Avavau, who is also the younger brother of, uh, of Halareva Fifita. But not only that, he is a former uh, New Zealand rugby um, All Blacks member. Yeah, and then now he plays professionally. Um, professionally, he plays out there in Wales with, um, with the Scarlets. Uh, also, uh, his teammate here, uh, Samuela, um, Samuela Losi, um, they play together. And if you're here for the first time and uh, watching this content, make sure you subscribe and uh, press like. And also, please share this content with uh, or uh, recommend our channel to uh, your friends um, as we continue. Moving on to our backs from number 9 to 15. Um, by the way, our number 9, um, Sonatane Takulua, is the heart and the captain of this team. It was just amazing. I mean, um, at the end of the game, he looked like a boxer. He looked like a Mike Tyson out there, you know, swinging away. And uh, he had one of the most beautiful tries I've ever seen. But, you know, it all started out with uh, Charles Piutau talking to him. He went over to number eight, Vaya Fifita, talked to him. And when the ball came out of the, of, of the scrum, yep, you knew it was going to be a try. And it was just beautiful, you know, from Vaya Fifita to um, Charles Piutau, Charles Piutau to um, uh, Fine Inisi. And then Inisi kicked it down and who made the try was just a beautiful thing from Sonatane Takulua. Yeah. Just to think that, that they talked it over and they planned it and you saw it. It was like watching American football with the quarterback or hey, uh, this play and we'll do this play. Yeah, let's do this. Yeah, that's exactly what they did and it was a try. Beautiful. So let's continue on. Like I said, our number, our backs, number nine to number 15, they are the fastest players in the team normally, and they are, they're not as big as your forwards, but they are very talented, fast, can handle the ball, can kick the ball, so here they are. With our captain, Sonatane Figahiva, Sonatane Takulua, from La Paha, Maufanga, from the island of Tonga Tapu, and from the island of Niuatopu Tapu and plays professionally out here in France, in uh, Asia. And moving on, our number 10, Figahongo Fulu, is William Havili from Kolomotua and Sopu from the beautiful island of Tonga Tapu. And you will also notice that the number 10 will do a lot of the kicking jobs for, for the team, so, um, or his replacement. And by the way, his birthday is on during the World Cup on September 9th. He will turn 25, also plays professionally for Moana Pacifica. And also from Moana Pacifica is our next player, number 11, Figatahataha, Fine Junior Inisi from Longotengi, from the beautiful island of Tonga Tapu, and also from Fangaleunga and the beautiful island of Haapai. Our going on, our number 12, Fikatahaua, Pita Aki, from the beautiful Sapaata, beautiful island of Eua, and also from Maufanga on the island of Tongatapu, and from Salei Moa from the island of Upolu. And I, and I believe uh, Upolu in Samo, is in Samoa, but not to forget um, that he plays professionally for, for uh, in France, for Toulouse, and... Um, you know, on the 24th of September, he will turn 31. So another birthday boy during the World Cup. Now moving on. Yes, uh, moving on to number 13, Figat Hatolu, is Malakai Fekitoa from Hafrahenga and Faleloa from the gorgeous island of Haapai. And um, yeah, and not to forget that he is a former All Blacks, but I'm um, happy to be back playing for his birth country. And, and, and also, he is playing in, um, he will be playing uh, when the, a new season begins in Benetton in Italy. Yeah, I guess he, he was, um, I'm not sure, Munster in, 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 um, in Ireland. I, I have to look that up. But yeah, his new, his new uh, country will be, um, yeah, in Italy. Moving on. Um, number 14, Figa Tafa, Isileri Folau from Maufanga and Folaha from the beautiful island of Tonga Tapu. And you know, shout out to Lenny Tua from Berlin out there who gave me some infos on, um, 
on Isleri Folau, they are um, finally selling his last property in, in, in uh, Sydney. So that means he's really moving out of Sydney and uh, just happy that he's playing for, for his ancestors, for his grandparents' land out there in the uh, island of Tonga, um, representing the Ikare Tahi. And we couldn't be happier for him, uh, really. I mean, uh, when you think that Isleri Folau is such a talented player, uh, former Wallabies from um, 2013 to 2019, um, playing two codes of, of rugby, you know, and also uh, Australian rugby. Unbelievable, the talent this guy has. And that's why I really think um, with some of the players that are playing now for Tonga, this is the most dangerous team Tonga has ever had. And it could be a, 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 a wonderful uh, group of death when we watch the World Cup. So uh, thanks to these players who are representing, who are coming back to the island and, and playing for them. Malo Aupit. And then, um, yeah, so um, moving on. Oh yeah, but I just forgot. I, I said uh, Australian rugby. I meant uh, Australian football, <laughs> which is different, a little bit different. Uh, but a rough game indeed. And uh, to have uh, this guy play all three is just amazing. Yeah, so um, uh, moving on. Uh, Fikatahanima, number 15, Sare Sipiutau or Charles Piutau uh, from Kolofo'o and from Folaha, um, from the gorgeous and beautiful and wonderful island of Tonga Tapu. Uh, and that is your backs here. And uh, he plays professionally uh, out there in England for the uh, Bristol Bears. And, um, you know, he is also tied for. Uh, um, with another South African player as the, the highest paid rugby players in the world. So uh, you're looking at Team Tonga, a very, very scary team coming for Halloween. Uh, that's when his birthday is at, uh, just a few days after the finals there of the World Cup. But I'm just saying Tonga, uh, it's gonna be a scary team come World Cup time. And um, this group of death, Better watch out for the island of Kingdom of Tonga. Um, the Ikare Tahi is an amazing team, and uh, so I hope a, a lot of you subscribe. Check it out. I'll try to make a content during the World Cup and bef leading up and also leading up to the World Cup. And what I saw against Australia A was uh, tells me that they will be good. And what I saw when, um, when they played against Fiji last week tells me they will be good because Fiji scored 19 points when Tanginoa Halaifonua, number six, went out to the sin bin for 10 minutes. So uh, the score doesn't tell you everything. To the reserves. So our reserves, well, they will be wearing jerseys number 16 to number 23. And, um, you know, there will be eight players, eight reserves. Um, and then um, I'll give you... Uh, their names. Uh, number 16, Siwa Maire from Veitong, Tongatapu, and from Mataaho, Eua. Number 17, Tau Kolomatangi from Pea, Havagatol, from the island of Tongatapu. Number 18, Figat Havalu, David Lolohea from Haasini, from the island of Tongatapu. And then our number 19, Siti Veni Mafi from Ahau, Kolovai from the island of uh, Tongatapu, and Sailoame Talau from Vavau. Moving on, number 20, Fika Wanoa, Sione Vailanu from Kolovai, from the island of Tongatapu. Moving on, um, Fika Wataha, number 21, Manu Paea from Perehake, and also from Maufanga, from the island of Tongatapu, and uh, from uh, Lotofoa, from the island group of Haapai. Yeah, Hogoatu. Moving on, number 22, Otomaka Mausia from Haateiho, from the island group of Tongatapu, and also from Longomapu, from the island group of Vavau. And now finally, our number 23, who made his debut against Australia there, Australia A, um, and also scored last week against Fiji. So he is number 23, Kiran Taumwefolao from Tuaneki Vare, I mean, beautiful island group of Vava'u, and also from Ha'afeva, the gorgeous island group of Ha'apai. And that's it for all your, your at least that was the, the, the squad for, for Australia, uh, Australia A game. Uh, let me give you the squad, and I won't read their names. I'll just post it up so you kind of have an idea what went on, and I'll also post up the, the names of the uh, team for Japan, uh, the squad for Japan. Here it is. But uh, for now, let's uh, look at last week's team uh, squad um, from um, 
from the squad list last week, the only changes that happened last week is that the um, Sio Maire came in as hooker. Uh, as you can see, the color here is a little different. And also uh, fly half number 10, uh, Otomaka Mausia came in. Okay, so um, let me see. And um, moving um, the rest of the players. Um, oh yes, and also you, you can see um, from Colo for O, Afusipa Tau Moiteau was in and um, and left wing for number 11, uh, Solomon Ekata from uh, Niua, Niua Fo'o and Lima Toa from the island group of Avao. So um, as you can see, there was a few changes and uh, that was, and um, we will move on to the reserves for the second half there for a game, last week's game against Fiji. And uh, everybody here seems like you've known them, they have played already. Um, since Australia, but the one person that haven't played at all, I, I believe it is Patrick Pellegrini. Um, yeah, that's he's a reserve from uh, from the from the island group of Tongataku. So I guess that's it. Now we're gonna move on to this week's uh, Japan's um, lineup for the squad um, on Saturday. Here it is, uh, playing in Osaka. Um, so this is this is the team that's gonna play. Um, if you've seen you've seen uh, the only changes here, like if, if we go to the forwards, we're looking at the forwards. Uh, the new forward, starting forward uh, for this week uh, is uh, on um, number five is uh, Siti Veni Mafi. Um, you know he's played before, and uh, our number eight are uh, Lopetti uh, Timani uh, from uh, Nabutoka Tongatapu on Vaipoa uh, New Atoptapu. So. Um, number eight is new. He hasn't played. He hasn't played in the reserves or anything, but he's, he'll be uh, starting in number eight. And then our normal number eight there, uh, Vaya Fifita, moved over to number six. Yes. Um, and our open flanker that we haven't really seen so far is um, number seven. Yes, and that would be Sione Haviri Taritui from Pangahi. Nomuka, beautiful island of uh, island group of Haapai, and Tofoa um, from um, Tongatapu, and also from the um, newer Fo'o. So, um, yes, that's number seven. Our number eight, as you've seen before, um, uh, no, our number eight is Lopeti Timani from uh, Nabutoka, Tongatapu, and also from Vaipoa, uh, newer Tongatapu. Yeah. So, um, that's it for our, our backs. Now moving on to our, I, I mean, that's it for our forwards. Moving on to our backs. Um, everybody's the same except you know everyone before. The only person that's, uh, so um, Sonatane um, Takulua is still captain. Will, William Havili is back and Pita Aki is back. And um, Afusipa Tamwepeau is still there as number 13. And Solomon Ekata, who played before, is also, um, is the right wing at number 14. And our left wing who scored last week is Kirin Taumwefulau, who is number 11. And of course, Charles Piltau is still there. Um, and that's it for the for the starting lineup for Japan. And going over to our, um, to look at our reserves. So our reserves, uh, as we have started from, uh, from two weeks ago, uh, from Australia, as you can see, you've already seen all of them. The only person that you really haven't seen is our number um, number 16, um, Paolo Ngawam from Vaini, and Kolomotua uh, in Fasi, and Kolofo'o in Tongatapu. And the other reserve, that number 17, it's uh, Feao Fotuaika um, from Pea and Tongatapu, from the island of Tongatapu. And then um, everybody else you've noticed, you've seen before, um, yes, uh, except for number 23, who will be George Moala. So um, that's it for the reserve against Japan, and we wish them a wonderful game. Yes, so um, wish them all the best in Japan. Um, so um, I, I will try to um, review some of the games uh, of the Japan game uh, at the end of, of their game, and so uh, watch out for that here on our uh, Tonga Island. And I thank you again. If you're here for, for the first time, please uh, subscribe if you haven't and uh, press like and please share our content and looking forward to our next content and again we'll try to finish this before 20 minutes take care till next time Ovat.